These guys, like him, don't realize other fighters have a say in things. What did he say? Oh. Lomachenko is ducking, ducking, ducking. If I tell you I'm good, probably you will say I'm boasting. But if I tell you I'm no good, you know one line. <laughs> Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PGAGM. Praise God to get buddy back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, baby. I know what time it is. The doctor's in the house. I had to close those blinds real quick, man. But check this out, though, man. There's some, there's some, there's some pretty big news. You know what I'm saying? Well, it's not really too big, but you know, I think it's it's, it's funny news. I should say, you know, it's stuff that I was talking about this whole past week. You know, especially if you've been uh, tuning into the live streams and all that and all that. You know, I've been talking about this topic for a while. You know, and it, and Bob Mafia has. Seemingly confirm what I've been saying, and that is that Lobachenko is ducking. I know you don't like to, uh, to, to admit it. I know you. I know it's hurt some of y'all heart. Look at you scared now, you ho. Scared like a little white pussy. But it's true. What Shakur has allegedly been calling Vasily Lomachenko, Duckchenko, Scarychenko. Big Bob Mafia, Bob Aram, the CEO, PimpinBob.net. You know what I'm talking about? He has seemingly confirmed it with his last interview, man. And I'm going to read it right now. You know what I'm talking about? And I quote, ah, These guys, like him, don't realize other fighters have a say in things. He paints a picture. Everybody's a puppet but him. Like, I can make any fight I want. Listening to pals and strangers on the internet doesn't serve Shakur because those folks have their own agendas and are not versed in the realities of big-time prize fighting. He has some good people around him, but the street people <laughs> who talk to him don't understand. You know, it's so funny. He's talking about street people. Um, What does he mean by that? What do you mean by that? <laughs> oh, let me close these blinds. It's a little bright out there, my bad. Yeah, so when he says street people, I mean, if, you, if, you, if you're familiar with the boxing landscape, then it was suggested he's talking about Jay Prince, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, everybody has their opinion. That's fine. But the emphasis on this that I want to focus on is that Lomachenko, he seemingly exposed Lomachenko saying that, hey, man, you know, uh, uh, fighters have a say, and I just can't make every fight that I want. So he suggested that he wanted to make the fight with Shakur and Lomachenko. Bullshit! 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 But Lomachenko, being one of the fighters in the situation... Didn't want the fight, you know, and which is what we've been knowing, man. I've been saying this, man. I, I, I will be honest, though. I've also mostly put it on Bob Arum, you know. I mostly put it on Bob Arum, but now Bob Arum is putting the blame on, on, on Lomachenko, you know. And let's get back to the street people, you know. I, <laughs> you know, I, I think he's talking about Jay Prince, and it's just funny because, you know, um, yeah, he's a businessman, but it's, the irony in talking about street people is, um, yeah, man, sometimes street people. Being from the street, have street smarts. And street smarts prevent you from continuously and, and, and consciously and unintentionally being victimized by people who operate in a fashion that would be bad business and unfortunate for yourself. So, you know, so, so of course, somebody who doesn't bend to Bob Arum's whim, you know, or, or, or you know, or bend, bend to his will, you know, he's, he's going to he's going to he's going to try to denounce them and discredit them. You know what I'm saying? But Jay Prince is a if, you, if you're familiar with, with uh, his 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 endeavors, he's 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 a great businessman in his own right. You know what I'm saying? And, and anybody's right, you know. Yeah. But uh, back to the topic, you know, a lot of people mistakenly say, oh, how come Lomachenko, how can you say Lomachenko is Dr. Shakur when he fought Teofimo? Ah! Like, do y'all even watch boxing? Do you you know when Tio fought Lomachenko, he was an underdog, right? Yeah. You know that it was an upset, right? Yeah. You know that Tio Fibo was also a top rank, right? Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? So Tio Fibo became Tio Fibo after beating Nomaschenko. He was not he was not known. I mean, he, he, if you watch boxing, you're gonna know Tio Fibo, but he became a star after beating Lomachenko in what was considered an upset at the time. So if you so if you you're, you're saying that he fought Tio Fibo, he made Tio Fibo. So so Tio Fibo was not even Tio Fibo himself yet. That's number one. So he fought somebody that was not expected to beat him. That's the point I'm getting at. So to say that he fought Tio, Tio Fibo is not telling the whole story and it's disingenuous. That's number one. Number two, people say, oh, well, he fought Haney. Ah. You're a fool if you think that Haney, no, no disrespect to Haney, but if you think that Haney poses as big of a threat to Lomachenko as Shakur does, you're a fool. I'll say it again. You're a fool. And then now, if you also erroneously state, oh, well, he's about to fight Tang now. Ah. He's about to fight Tang now because what? Bob Arum is about to sacrifice him like as tribute like it was Hunger Games. I volunteer! I volunteer! I volunteer as tribute! 
<laughs> you know what I'm saying? Bob Arab is ready now because what's the consensus around boxing? I think it's erroneous, but what is the, what is the consensus? The word around the boxing landscape is that Lomachenko is getting old. He only has a few fights left. He looks spectacular against Cat Bosa. He even stopped him. You know, so I disagree that, that he's, that he's slowing down. I think people, when they hear an age for certain people, they just automatically say, oh, they're, they're, they're out of their prime. I do, do I think that he's in his, his peak form? No, but do I think he's still good enough to beat a lot of people? Yes. Was Errol Spence in his peak form, peak form when he fought Terrence Crawford? No. But does Terrence Crawford still beat the hell out of him? Yes, you know what I'm saying? So, and, and he still gets credit for that, as he should. You know what I'm saying? So everything is, you know, Javante take Davis and Lomachenko, I would have liked for it to happen a long time ago, but people greatly exaggerate how long they've been in the same weight class together. They haven't been in the same weight class for that long. That's number one. Number two... They're, they're operating across the street. One's with PBC, one's with top rank. So the one that you should really be mad about is Shakur versus Lomachenko not happening. That's the one that everybody should be mad at because that was the easiest and still is the easiest fight to facilitate. Though. Check this out, though. First of all, you're throwing too many big words at me, okay? Now, because I don't understand them, I'm going to take them as disrespect. Watch your mouth. And Bob dropped the ball. But now Bob, who, were, who I accused of dropping the ball, he said, oh, no, 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 cuzzy. It wasn't my ball to drop. Pause. Lomachenko, Dubchenko, Scarychenko, as Shakur Stevenson has long alleged, he's the one that dropped the ball. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that in the comments, man. I just thought it was interesting. I thought it was funny. And I, I, hey, Bob said it himself. Now, you know, people are going to come around and say, oh, well, Bob didn't mean it like that. They're going to make excuses and all this stuff. You know, people don't like facts. You know what I'm talking about? They're only interested in the truth when, the, and they're only interested in facts and evidence when that facts and evidence and information, uh, uh, um, justifies or validates or makes them feel comfortable in believing their already preconceived notions. You know what I'm saying? People don't really want to know the truth. They just want to they just want to hear anything that will back up the stance that they currently have. But yeah, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. Bob done slipped up and he done put Lobachenko on blast, man. Y'all be easy. Don't forget to like the video, but most importantly, don't forget, man. With God, we can do anything. Without God, we are nothing. Y'all be easy. The doctor's out. Peace. By the way, you see the tweet right there. Go follow your boy on Twitter, man. Y'all know what time it is. Dr. Boxer Talk on Twitter. You know what I'm talking about? Go check me out, man. From the hood to college, both worlds, they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.